Welcome to Chanakya IAS Academy's Current Affair MCQs. Let's see today's questions. Question number one. Siva Sankari, who received the Saraswati Samman 2022, is a famous author of which language? The options are A. Malayalam, B. Tamil, C. Telugu, and D. Kannad. The correct answer is B. Tamil. Noted author and activist Siva Sankari was honored with the prestigious Saraswati Samman for the year 2022 for her memoir which is written in Tamil Surya Vamsam. The Saraswati Samman was instituted by the KK Birla Foundation and Siva Sankari is the 32nd recipient of the award. The Saraswati Samman given annually for outstanding literary works in 22 Indian languages in the last 10 years. Question number 2. Which city hosted the G20 Parliamentary Speaker Summit in 2023? The options are A. New Delhi, B. Dhaka, C. Jakarta, and D. Colombo. The correct answer is A. New Delhi. Prime Minister Narendra Modi inaugurated the 9th G20 Parliamentary Speaker Summit in New Delhi. The two-day summit was preceded by a parliamentary forum on mission life. Apart from G20 countries, 10 other countries were invited to the conference. The theme of the 9th P20 summit was Parliaments for One Earth, One Family and One Future. Question number 3. What is India's retail inflation recorded in the month of September? The options are A. 7.02% B. 6.02% C. 5.02% and D 4.02%. The correct answer is C 5.02%. India's retail inflation in terms of the consumer price index CPI eased to a 3 month low in September to 5.02%. Moreover, the inflation came below RBI's upper tolerance band of 2% to 6%. RBI has clarified that it is targeting inflation of 4% and a figure of below 6% may not suffice as a condition for easing its lending rates. Question number 4. Which institution has initiated a pilot program for wholesale digital rupee in call money market? The options are A. SEBI, B. RBI, C. Niti Aayog, and D. NPCI. The correct answer is B. RBI. The Reserve Bank of India initiated a pilot program for the wholesale segment of its central bank digital currency in the interbank call money market. As per media reports, nine banks including four public sector banks and five private sector banks are participating in the e-rupee call money pilot. This is the second use case of testing wholesale CBDC the first being the government securities market introduced in November last year. Question number 5. What is the rank of India in the Global Hunger Index 2023? The options are A. 101 B. 111 C. 121 and D. 131 Correct answer is B. 111 In the Global Hunger Index 2023, India is ranked 111 out of 125 countries, indicating that its progress in combating hunger has stagnated since 2015. With a score of 28.7 in the 2023 Global Hunger Index, India has a level of hunger that is classified as serious. Afghanistan, Haiti, and 12 sub-Saharan countries have fared worse than India on the Global Hunger Index 2023. We conclude today's session here. Tomorrow we will meet few more MCQs. Till then, please like, share and subscribe our channel. Thank you. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon to never miss an update.